Reggie Watts is perhaps the most successful entertainer to ever come out of Great Falls. He's a comedian, he's an actor, he's a musician, and a beatboxer. But later this month, he'll add author to his list of titles when he publishes his first book. I thought, well, it's about my life, and I remember most of it, so why not write it down? So. Um... <laughs> The title of the book is Great Falls, Montana, Fast Times, Post-Punk Weirdos, and a Tale of Coming Home Again. Reggie calls it his love letter to the town he grew up in, filled with stories that describe how a multiracial kid from a small town became an internationally beloved performer. You know, it was like one thing would trigger another thing, and the more I thought about it, or having conversations with people that I knew, you know, growing up, or talking to my mom about stories and getting her remembrances as well you know it, it, it all kind of started to fill in a little bit more and and to hear reggie tell it the book is just step one ideally he'd like to use the memoir as a springboard for a television show and use that to expand opportunities for kids in great falls i feel lucky because growing up at the time that i did the school systems were so well funded um that you know we could do whatever the hell we wanted to do so i know that that's that's decreased quite a bit in the last uh, many decades. And so, so that is a, a big thing for me. I like to encourage kids to pursue science and, and art. And that's my, my major thing. Cause that's, but luckily we had great science programs and great art programs when I was growing up. So I, I want to continue that. But Reggie admits all this will only happen if Great Falls is cool with it. I hope that I get to make the show. And based off of Yellowstone, like <laughs> I, I know that people were not happy with Yellowstone. Like all the Bozemanites um, were, were very kind of bummed about it. And and I get it because it like definitely boosted home prices and all that stuff and like made it harder in many ways for people there. So now I'm trying to question because like, I wanted to film in Great Falls. But if I do film in Great Falls, um and, and and it makes sense then i, I want to make sure that it works with the community like i want to have like the community involved so it doesn't feel like this bum rush of you know me just going like i'm going to make my tv show here in great falls and like have everyone go like oh great another hollywood blah blah you know it's like i i, I don't want that at all the book comes out on October 17th, and the tour promoting the book makes stops in Bozeman, Missoula, before concluding at the Newberry and Great Falls on October 27th. Tom Wiley, MTN News.